YouTube, I'd uh, like to do a video about the layering system. Uh, the layering system through summer, right through to winter, autumn, all the way through. I mean, most people talk about layering for winter time and layering for summer time, and usually all you need to do is change a few pieces. So I'll start off with the base layer in the summer time, and that's usually a t shirt which is uh, not cotton, it's a, a polyester t-shirt and it's uh, designed to take the moisture away from your body so it's got to be high wicking and, uh, and uh, be able to dry quickly so it's a high wicking quick dry t-shirt made by Regatta but I mean anything really as long as it's not cotton on your base layer normal pair of shorts, boxer shorts or whatever you normally wear again stay away from cotton and a pair of socks I mean the socks that I normally wear are just uh, normal sort of like everyday sort of uh, socks but these are caramel walking socks and they're um, a wool um, and acrylic blend these socks are but basically that's what you need for your base layer then you move on to your warm insulated layer and this is in the case of a, a micro fleece on the top and again this is a, made by a company called Crag Hoppers but I mean it doesn't matter what fleece you wear and the summer trousers to go with that uh, again Crag Hoppers these are Ventura trousers, good um, quick drying trousers, even in summer you need to still get the moisture away from your good wicking and uh, really good trousers. These are trousers I'll still use in winter, I mean or one similar to like that. And uh, then on your legs, waterproofs to keep your legs dry and keep the wind out and a Gore-Tex coat. Again, this is uh, breathable to get the moisture away from your body. So that's in summer. In the winter, there's not a lot of difference between it, apart from I usually get rid of the t-shirt and then I use a base layer, which is fleece, um, leggings or fleece uh, base layer with a thin fleece top and then my insulating layer which is again the micro fleece on the, tr on the legs again the same trousers over the top if it's uh, still cold, then I use a soft shell top on top of that. And this again, this is fleece lined, good uh, wicking, allows moisture through. This uh, top is uh, windproof and water repellent. And with the socks in winter, I most of the time I would keep with the same socks, but these are uh, really thick winter winter socks and sometimes I'll even put a second really thin pair of uh, polyester socks on top of that again staying away from the cotton on my feet in the summer most of the time I'd go out with uh, these sort of boots these are um, uh, Gore-Tex boots keep your feet dry but in the winter I would change those so these boots, these are a company called Lower, these are Lower Mountain Boots, really good strong pair of boots, big brown soles, and uh, again keep your feet good dry and good wicking properties on these as well. On the uh, top after that, back to the same coat, Vortex coat and the waterproofs on the bottom as well. Then with your, 
with your head in the summer. I use this hat. Again, it's waterproof and uh, breathable. So when you sweat, it allows the heat out and the water moisture out. It keeps your head dry. In the winter, I change the hat to a uh, um, a acrylic thinulate hat. Or if it's really cold, and then I change it to the uh, Ruskin style sort of hat, where again you can fold it up. And this is a fleece as well. Gloves. Another pair of uh, thinulate gloves to keep your hands dry. We could do with an outer cover on them. I haven't got it at the moment. Around the neck, one of these buffs, and uh, all this has stopped the air pumping out of your out of your coat, or out of your top, and keep your um, keep the warm air in instead of put it out. I also got one of these neck warmers. This is a uh, a fleece one, and that's got a toggle there where you can tighten it up again to stop the air pumping out of there. You could wear something like this, a shemag. Again, good for wrapping over your head, round your neck, stop the air pumping out. And that's about it. And this is my clothes for summer, autumn, all the way through to winter, about summer again. If you enjoyed the video, if there's any uh, comments you'd like to make on the system, please let me know. Thanks for watching.